viewers i hope you are all fine this ultrasound video shows multiple types of ovarian cysts three types of ovarian cysts with the fibroid in the same patient you can see the uterus having a large fibroid this is urinary bladder this one is the uterine mass fibroid this is cervix there are various types of ovarian cysts such as dermoid cyst and endometrial endometrioma cyst however functional cysts are the most common types the two types of functions functional cysts include follicle and corpus luteal corpus luteum cysts now you can see three types of multiple cysts endometrial cysts are also called endometrioma they are filled with dark brown endometrial fluid and are sometimes referred to as chocolate cysts the presence of endometriomas indicates a more severe stage of endometriosis endometrioma can lead to chronic pelvic pain and infertility and often requires surgery for treatment now you can see the one is the simple cyst in the right ovary and the left ovary shows two types of cysts one is the endometrial cyst that is chocolate cyst also called this is the simple cyst right ovarian cyst and this one is the left ovarian hemorrhagic cyst you can see multiple internal echoes inside the fluid in this hemorrhagic cyst as due to the bleeding occurred in this cyst this is the chocolate cyst also called endometriomal endometrioma this cyst has a more homogeneous fluid thick fluid in its interior and the simple cyst has a clear fluid without any internal echoes in its interior these are the three cysts and a fibroid is also seen it is not sure what causes endometriosis or ovarian endometriomas the most commonly explained reason is that endometriosis happens because some of the endometrial like tissue that is shed during a female menstrual flows backwards that is retrograde menstruation now you can see a large fibroid in the distal portion of the uterine cavity hemorrhagic cyst is an ovarian cyst it is a sac that forms on the ovary and swells up with fluid if the cyst bleeds it is called hemorrhagic ovarian cyst if a hemorrhagic cyst breaks open it can release blood and fluid into the lower belly and pelvis you may not have symptoms from the cyst some ruptured ovarian cyst can cause a lot of bleeding these they need medical treatment right away in severe cases the blood loss can cause less blood flow to other organs simple ovarian cyst most of the time you have little or no discomfort and the cyst are harmless most cysts go away without treatment within a few months but sometimes ovarian cyst can become twisted or burst open that is ruptured this can lead this can cause serious symptoms now you can see this is the fibroid in the distal portion of the uterine cavity and multiple ovarian cysts are seen thanks for watching please subscribe my channel if you do like this video please click the like button thanks